Welcome to our Tech Explainer video. Today we're tackling a question that many developers encounter when working with C and C++. Can the depth of header file inclusions increase without limit? And is it possible to set a limit at compile time? Let's break it down together. Welcome back to another technical video. Today we're going to be going through a question, going through those answers, and hopefully it leads to your solution. Remember, stay a little bit crazy, just like me, to get through to your resolution. Now let's get started. When including header files in C or C++, the depth of include files can indeed increase, but it is not without limits. Most compilers impose a limit on the maximum depth of nested includes to prevent excessive resource consumption. For example, GCC has a default limit of 1024 nested includes, which can be adjusted using specific compiler flags. To specify a limit at compile time, you can use the dash include option in GCC to include a specific header file before processing others. In summary, while header files can be included multiple times, there are practical limits enforced by compilers to ensure efficient compilation. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. There's a limit to how deep header files can be included, and this varies by compiler. The C standard specifies that at least 15 levels of nesting must be supported. However, in practice, you might not reach this limit unless there's a loop in your includes. For example, if you create a loop in your header files, like including a header within itself, you'll encounter an error. GCC can handle around 200 levels before failing, while MSVC only supports 10 levels, making it non-conforming to the standard. And that's it guys. We've gone through, answered your questions, and hopefully found that solution you're looking for. If we did, please hit subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. And until next time, I hope you have a good one. Bye.